Hello, this is Rambo. I hope you are well. I do have some rather big news to share. I have had a baby boy and am now a real grown-up mummy. My son's name is Benjamin, or Benji for short. And he is eight months old now, I think. Time flies as a mum. I love him very much, and he is very sweet. Uh, most of the time. I am still getting the hang of being a mummy and learning things all the time. Benji's dad is my special friend, Purple. I suppose Benji will be as big and strong as him one day. But I really hope Benji takes after me in the common sense department. Benji is very popular with my friends. Prince, Freddy, and Rosie. They are like his aunts and uncles. And they help me look after him, as being a mummy is a real balancing act. I can't just do what I want, when I want, all the time now. Honestly, often I'm just completely flat out. Handily, Auntie Rosie often takes him for walks in the mornings around our place, making sure he gets out and about. These walks do seem to tire him out a little. He is very sleepy sometimes. While in the afternoons, Uncle Freddy keeps him entertained, pushing him along the beach in his favourite toy truck. He is very lucky to have such a loving and caring family. Uncle Prince also loves spending time with Benji. He is an excellent driver and has taken Benji under his wing. I'm happy that Benji is starting driving lessons early, as I started when I was young. And as you know, I am an excellent driver now. Recently, Benji has even started to drive by himself and seems to have a fairly good feel for the road. But I've decided that until he passes his test, I won't be letting him drive on the highway. Safety first. Benji really loves the beach. I take him there most days so he gets some healthy sea air. And he loves playing with my toys. I am teaching him how to play with everything properly, as he doesn't know about everything like me just yet. As you know, I am a real fashionista and influencer so I'm very particular about his wardrobe. I choose some chic designer outfits for him so he always looks super cool. In fact, we've already done a couple of shoots for magazines and TV. As you can imagine, the fact I have a new baby is big news internationally. Mummy's job is never over, and I do find it very hard work. Benji is often hungry, and I have to feed him all the time. At the moment, his favourite food is milk, but he is just starting to try some solids. Nuts and fruits, mainly. He is particularly starting to like bananas, which I love too. In the afternoons, it's bath time for Benji. He does get rather grubby during the day, so I put him in the bath and wash him. He especially likes a foamy bubble bath with his favourite rubber duck. The work just never stops as a mum. Afterwards, I dry him so he doesn't catch a cold. And he always smells like roses after a warm bath. Not going to school just yet, 
but I do want him to have a great start in life, so his education is very important to me. I am teaching Benji about biology and nature. I am something of an expert. He is very interested in animals and loves learning about them. But I also want to make sure he develops his artistic side. As you know, I am very creative and I definitely want Benji to follow in my footsteps. In particular, I am keen he learns to express himself through art. So he is already learning to paint. He is just a beginner at the moment, but he is showing some early promise. He is obviously not yet an established abstract expressionist like me. But I will guide him with my knowledge of today's trends in the art world. One day, I hope we will be able to display our work together at an exhibition at the Louvre. That will be a dream come true. At the end of the day, I normally read him stories before bed. His current favourite is called the Plucky Orangutan. The heroine is called Oma, and Benji loves hearing about her exciting adventures with her friend Amir. But come to think of it, me, Benji and the gang have plenty of exciting adventures of our own. Being a mummy is truly exhausting, and Benji also gets very tired at night. So I try to put him to bed around 7pm, before I roll off to bed too. Night-night and see you soon. Love, Rambo.